owners of Dairy Delight acknowledge they do have the bacteria that causes Q fever here on their farm, but they don't believe the people who have gotten sick did so from drinking raw milk. At Dairy Delight in Livingston County, more than 250 families take part in a cow boarding program where they own a share of the cows and pay for their care and in return have access to raw milk. But state officials say three women who participate in the program recently were diagnosed with Q fever. All had consumed raw milk, which is not homogenized or pasteurized and can't even be sold in Michigan grocery stores. It's a whole milk. In other words, no cream has been taken off of it, and it's fresh. I actually prefer the fresh, unprocessed uh, product because I believe that it contains material, including uh, beneficial bacteria, that is not processed, that is not present in milk that has been pasteurized. And so I go out of my way to get that and pay a little more for it. Dr. Ted Beals is a local expert in raw milk who consumes the milk from Dairy Delight. He says he doesn't think the three women got sick from drinking the beverage. I think it's extraordinarily unlikely that they did. Almost everybody agrees that you become sick from this, from dust particles that you breathe, and the thing that contaminates those dust particles is from animals that have recently given birth. The owner of the farm, Crystal Unger, declined to speak on camera at the advice of her lawyer, but tells us the bacteria that causes Q fever is present in the cows, but says it's more likely the women got sick from being around the animals rather than consuming the milk. That was Michael Rosenfield reporting there. Three women are recuperating right now. One of them needed a prolonged hospital stay. Q fever is rare but quite serious when contracted by humans because it can lead to long-term illness. Symptoms include high fever, headache, joint and body aches, chills and sweats, chest pain, nausea and vomiting. Doctors say most people recover, but it can lead to serious illness, including pneumonia and organ damage.